What needs to happen to make the euro viable going forward? Does there need to be a central oversight of all uh, financial institutions from the ECB in Frankfurt? Yeah, I think the, it's, it's easy to see this in, in terms of a, of a, a more Europe programme, which had sort of slowed and stalled. Um, when the euro, euro was being designed in the late 80s and early 90s, there were people who pointed out that probably banking supervision should be centralised as well. Mm. Um, but they didn't win out on the occasion. It seemed ambitious enough to put the currency union and the monetary single monetary policy in place. Uh, unfortunately, this, uh, the country's banking and fiscal situations were not always managed in a way that was consistent with that single monetary policy and there was a degree of complacency uh, which shows that probably it needed to be more control, there needed to be more control of fiscal, more control of banking on a central pooled basis. So you're basis. comfortable with that, you think it's the right thing to do? Well, I think it's definitely the right way to, way to go. It, it would viable. have been better if mm. it had been done before the crisis. Okay. Inventing adjustments of that type in the middle of the crisis is not easy because mm. you tend to get pushed to doing the most urgent things instead of the most important things, yes. maybe, and uh, speed is of the essence. And it's not easy to set up a, a banking supervision system for the whole of Europe okay. in, in a short period of time.